T. Johnson Hospital in Dunn will no longer deliver babies in Harnett County. And the hospital is operated by Cape Fear Valley Health System in Fayetteville. And WR's Gilbert Bays is live after speaking with the hospital administrators about this decision that will affect hundreds of expectant mothers. Gilbert, what do they tell you? Well, well, Jeff, this is about the numbers, basically is what it boils down to. This hospital, this is Bessie Johnson Hospital here uh, in Dunn, delivers between 300 and 400 babies a year. Then you throw into, into this mixture here the uh, uh, medical shortage that was created by the pandemic. Then you get a better sense of why this hospital is not going to be delivering any babies. Now, this is a nationwide problem. They're called maternity deserts. We're told about 36% of the counties in the United States don't provide labor and delivery services. And here in North Carolina, 21 of our 100 counties don't have hospitals with maternity wards. Administrators say the decision to stop delivering babies at this hospital goes beyond finances. The most important factor is the safety of the babies and their mothers. Right now we're delivering about one baby on average a day up there. It's very difficult to staff a unit um, for that volume, particularly when there's an emergency and you go from needing one or two nurses to many nurses at one time. Now, the hospital says that um, they will continue to provide other OBGYN services and will work closely with patients to transfer records for those who want their babies delivered outside the hospital, uh, the system of Cape Fear Valley Health System. But some of those services, again, still will be provided here. Uh, the closest hospital probably for those who are um, uh, in a maternity status right now would be to go to UNC Hospital in Johnston County. Uh, Jeff, they're hoping that the patients here will come down to Fayetteville because a lot of the doctors here that work at Bessie Johnson work very closely with the hospital in Fayetteville. But if you want to make a change, the hospital is going to work very closely with you to make that a, a transition as smooth as possible. That's 